Hello, hello. I am back to help you do this thing called life. So you absolutely know I was praying for you, right? And as I was praying for you, um, I started to hear some scriptures that I really take uh, comfort in when I need strength, when I feel like I'm getting tired. And um, some of these scriptures look, when I heard a preacher say them, I was like, that's in the Bible. You know how you read the Bible, but you know, what was I going through? And then the thing is, we can read the same scripture 365 days a year. And if we position ourselves to hear God, he'll show us a different little nuance. He'll show us something different each time, because honestly, it's according to where we are, how we receive it. So anyway, the scripture that I want to share with you today is Isaiah 30, verse 15. And it says, For thus saith the Lord God, the Holy One of Israel, In returning and rest shall ye be saved. In quietness and in confidence shall be your strength, and ye would not. So, yeah, they're getting rebuked. Because the Lord is, he's already told them the way to their victory, the way to being okay. And uh, in case you haven't heard this scripture, I just want to assure you, that's the way that you're going to be okay. He says, in returning, returning to him, and in rest shall ye be saved. You're going to be all right when you rest in him. Return to him. You've tried to do it on your own. You've gone to other people wanting it to get done, wanting somebody to make you okay, wanting somebody to make things better. And it's not going to happen. He said, in returning and rest, ye shall be saved. But this is the thing that blows me away. And, and this is the part of the scripture that I always remember. In quietness and in confidence shall be your strength. Whew. Sometimes, y'all, we just talk too much. Sometimes it is that outward thing, that nagging, that fussing at your husband, fussing at the kids, talking to the co-workers. Just be quiet. Be quiet. And then after you're quiet on the outside, quiet your insides. In quietness and in confidence. Being confident that you're right where God needs you to be at this time. Confidence that God is still God. He's still on the throne. He's going to work things out. Just be confident in him. In quietness and in confidence shall be your strength. So when you're quiet and when you're confident in who God is in your life, strength shows up. You know, we lose strength when we're trying to work so hard. And sometimes it doesn't even take all that. It just takes you sitting back saying, you know what, God, I've done all I can do. And then you can get your strength again. So anyway, I just want you to take courage in that word. Don't get tired now. Relax in him so you can get the strength you need to make it through this day. This has been One More Minute with Marcy. I'll be back tomorrow with another moment of momentum producing motivation. Until then, be encouraged. And remember, you got to flutter before you fly. But flying is in your future. <laughs>